I'm just getting word in my ear about some breaking news across the National Football League. I do want to transition into the NFL anyway to talk about some of the big-time headlines. And let's go to Miami, where the Dolphins are expected to cut in Dominican Stew. Do- star defensive tackle there. Sue is expected to be released as soon as today. And you see that big-time cap hit there. $26.1 million in 2018. The Dolphins can save $17 million if Sue is cut after June 1st. But you could see uh, some $17 million in savings there. But and Dominic and Sue, a star frontline player. And it seems like the Dolphins are going through some changes here where obviously they are dealing away. Jarvis Landry, he's going to the Cleveland Browns. There's uncertainty at the quarterback position with Ryan Tannehill, but you look at the salary cap situation here, and that's what it all comes down to for many of these teams because, first of all, the negotiating period will start at 12 o'clock Eastern time. So you have that happening, and decisions have to be made. So Indomitian and Sue reportedly is a designated cut for post-June 1st, so that's when the savings would kick in there, and you have... A lot of teams with a good amount of cap space, like the 49ers, like the Browns, that's why they're going to be active in free agency. Meanwhile, for the Miami Dolphins, they're kind of at that midway point. You know, they're not in a great salary cap situation, but they're not in a bad one either. And dealing away Jarvis Landry certainly helps them in terms of their cap hit because they would have to pay Jarvis like $16 million if they were to go through with that franchise tag there. Obviously not the case because he's going away, and that won't be official, by the way, until March 14th, when a trade can become official. But obviously, the Miami Dolphins are going through some turnover here, and Adamic and Sue expected to be a post-June 1st cut, and there you see the $17 million in savings there.